Welcome to the cybersecurity tutorial series designed to help you better protect your information and devices from cyber attacks. Tutorial 8, securely erasing files. Where do deleted files go? When you delete a file, depending on your operating system and your settings, it may be transferred to your trash or recycle bin. This holding area essentially protects you from yourself. If you accidentally delete a file, you can easily restore it. However, you may have experienced the panic that results from emptying the trash bin prematurely or having a file seem to disappear on its own. The good news is that even though it may be difficult to locate, the file is probably still somewhere on your machine. The bad news though is that even though you think you've deleted a file, an attacker or unauthorized person may be able to retrieve it. Think of the information you have saved on your computer. Is there banking or credit card information, tax returns, passwords, medical or other personal data, personal photos, sensitive corporate information? How much would someone be able to find out about you or your company by looking through your computer files? What are the risks? You may become a victim of identity theft. Another possibility is that the information could be used in a social engineering attack. Attackers may use information they find out about you or an organization you're affiliated with to appear to be legitimate and gain access to sensitive data. Check out tutorial 15, Avoiding Social Engineering Attacks. It provides more in-depth information on this topic. Can you erase files by reformatting? Reformatting your hard drive, CD or DVD may superficially delete the files, but the information is still buried somewhere. Unless those areas of the disk are effectively overwritten with new content, it is possible that knowledgeable attackers may be able to access the information. How can you be sure your information is completely erased? Some people use extreme measures to make sure information is destroyed, but these measures can be dangerous and may not be completely successful. Use software to erase your information. Your best option is to investigate software programs and hardware devices that claim to erase your hard drive, CD or DVD. Even so, these programs and devices have varying levels of effectiveness. Look for the following software characteristics. Secure Arrays is performed. Secure Arrays is a standard in modern hard drives. If you select a program that runs the Secure Arrays command, it will erase data by overriding all areas of the hard drive, even areas that are not being used. Also check that data is written multiple times. It is important to make sure that not only the information is erased, but the new data is writing over it. By adding multiple layers of data, the program makes it difficult for an attacker to peel away the new layer. Three to seven passes is fairly standard and should be sufficient. Also look to see if random data is used in the software. Using random data instead of easily identifiable patterns makes it harder for an attacker to determine the pattern and discover the original information underneath. Also check to see if zeros are used in the final layer. Regardless of how many times the program overwrites the data, look for programs that use all zeros in the last layer. This adds an additional level of security. While many of these programs assume that you want to erase an entire disk, there are programs programs that give you the option to erase and overwrite individual files also. Destroy data physically. An effective way to ruin a CD or DVD is to wrap it in a paper towel and shatter it. However, there's also hardware devices that erase CDs and DVDs by destroying their surface. Some of these devices actually shred the media itself, while others puncture the writable surface with a pattern of holes. Many paper shredders will also shred CDs and DVDs. If you decide to use one of these devices, compare the various features and prices to determine which option best suits your needs. Tutorial 9, Proper Disposal of Electronic Devices provides more in-depth information on this topic. Check out more videos from this cybersecurity tutorial series to learn how you can better protect your information and devices from cyber attacks.
Cyber Health is powered by the Chamber of Commerce and Industry Queensland and RED. This project is funded by the Australian Government Department of Industry, Science, Energy and Resources through the Cybersecurity Business Connect and Protect program. For more information, visit cyberhealth.com.au.